Hello YouTube fam, what's popping? Hope y'all are doing great. Well it's Royal Guard again with another banger. So if it's your first time here, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications. Trust broken. Kate Middleton's only way to regaining public trust after photo blunder LS highly unlikely. Regaining trust is a big hurdle for Kate Middleton, but there's a way, albeit a highly unlikely one, she can do it. Kate Middleton has a difficult road ahead after releasing and subsequently apologizing for an edited family photo. According to an expert, the Princess of Wales, 42, has one option for regaining the public's trust. The clincher? It's probably not going to happen. Ahead, details on Kate's Photoshop fail scene around the world and how she can repair the damage. In the first official photo of Kate in 2024, and her first non-paparazzi sighting since the 2023 holiday season, Kensington Palace released a photo on March 10, 2024. It marked Mother's Day in the UK and featured Kate and her children. Taken by Prince William, the photo, posted to Instagram and X, showed a smiling Kate with the couple's kids, Prince George, 10, Princess Charlotte, 8, and Prince Louis, 5. The seemingly harmless image, after all, the royal families known to share the occasional Wales family photo, soon became the center of a controversy. Irregularities were spotted online. Then came kill notices from photo agencies such as Giddy Images and Reuters due to manipulation concerns. Finally, on March 11, 2024, the palace issued a brief statement from Kate, who owned up to editing the photo. Like many amateur photographers, I do occasionally experiment with editing, she said. I wanted to express my apologies for any confusion the family photograph we shared yesterday caused. I hope everyone celebrating had a very happy Mother's Day, she added, once again signing off with C for Catherine. Nick Eade, a brand and culture expert, believes the photo editing controversy has Kate and Kensington Palace in a particularly tough situation. They were trying to quash rumors, he told Newsweek, referencing the growing speculation surrounding Kate's abdominal surgery. First, there were conspiracy theories online that reached a fever pitch. Then, the first 2024 sighting of Kate came in the form of a paparazzi photo showing her in the car with her mother, Carol Middleton. And now the first official photo of Kate gets called out for editing. Now they've completely fueled them in an even bigger way that has gone around the world because all the picture agencies were saying they wouldn't use it because it was basically a fake. It's really tough for them, there's no way back, he continued. The only way forward is to kind of explain themselves, which they've tried to do. But people aren't buying it because the palace now aren't going to reveal the actual original image. It's all about trust. There's no way back unless she, Kate, makes a personal appearance before Easter, which I don't think she's going to do, Eve concluded. In their initial announcement of Kate's surgery, Kensington Palace said she's unlikely to return to public duties until after Easter, or March 31, 2024. For now, Kate's continuing her recovery at home in Windsor, England, with no official date set for her return to royal duties. At the time of writing, Kensington Palace hasn't announced when Kate will be back to work. Previously, it was reported Trooping the Color, the British royal family's annual birthday celebration for the Sovereign, would be Kate's first public appearance since undergoing surgery, thanks to the British Army's website. Amid reports, however, they removed Kate's name, meaning her recovery continues, and her return date remains unknown.